Hi guys, welcome back for another reaction. This time around, I'm checking out another track of Diana Ann Kudanova. You know, I've already done my first spin with her music and was completely blown away because her vocal range is so different than any female I think I've ever heard before. And I couldn't put a finger on what her sound was. Um, you know, I've done choir throughout the years and I've never performed with anybody who has her octave range that's female. Um, so I did some digging cause I wanted to find out more about her voice. And so it turns out that she's called what's called a contralto and it's a type of alto, uh, you know, and most altos, I believe they range between like the octaves of F3 to F5 ish, but with a contralto, they can go a lot deeper. Almost, they almost are comparable to a tenor, if not the, like the same ranging in tenors. And so that's what Diana and Kudanova can do with her vocals. And I thought, whoa. That just kind of blew my mind because I'd never heard of contraltos before this point. And so now I'm really interested to see what she does with more music because I really was not expecting the vocals that she had. With that said, uh, I'm going to dig into this Elvis track and it'll be interesting to see because, you know, Elvis was quite deep tone as well. So it'll see, it'll be cool to see. Does she do more traditional what he does or does she really shake it up? We're going to find out. Um, before we get started, just want to let you know if by chance this video has to be blocked because of the owners of the video, I'll throw a photo over it like I did with the first video, Renchenka, that I reviewed. That's just so that we can get this on here so you guys can get my actual first reaction to what she's doing authentically so you see what I hear and in, in experience the first time around. So that's why the last one had that, that block across the, the front of the video. So... Anyway, let's just go ahead and get started here. For those of you brand new to my channel today, thanks for coming. If you've never heard of Diana before and you're giving her a first chance, thanks for giving this artist a chance and to be heard because I think it's so important that we work to continue to help artists around the world get known in front of other audiences that they don't already have and for people to experience what they do. It's just so magical to hear all the great things that are going on around the world in music today. For those of you returning back with me that are our fans of Diana, welcome. Thanks for coming back. And, you know, I, I wonder if I'm going to feel the same way you felt the first time you heard this song particularly. And for the rest of you coming back that aren't necessarily, you know, decided yet if you are a Diana fan, but you're coming back just to watch it with me. Thanks for coming back as well. You guys, if you are not subscribed to my channel, just click that button below the subscribe. And if you want to get notified, hit the bell. If you wouldn't mind doing a thumbs up, like on this and share the video to help me with the YouTube algorithm and also to help Diana to continue to grow other fans out there as well, wherever space we can fit her in so people can find her to help her. There's never enough video out there to help artists that are up and coming and that are in other areas that people may not know about yet. So with that said, let's just dive on into her Elvis cover. I'm really interested to see what she does with it this time um, and what tone she goes with for this one and, and the arrangement that she plays the music, the music arrangement that's going to play with her. So let's see how this is going to play out. And <laughs> I'm so excited. All right. I'm bracing myself. <sighs> Am I ready? Okay. I'm ready. Here we go. Okay, that's a high pitch note. Is she going to go higher this time? Let's 
Любые слова из лишних. Диана Анкудинова. Окей. So cool. Like that guy in the back row, that, uh, he must be the judge. Him standing up and like, he felt the way I feel. And it's, I think almost like watching her with the song contest is, is fun to me because I'm experiencing it with other people at the same time that they experienced it. And, <laughs> so when I'm feeling that way and they're feeling it, it's like this massive connection. Like, oh, so good. <laughs> like, wow. I mean, she was all over the place with her octaves. That was so cool. Like, and the control. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> she is the bringer of chills and the bringer of tears and wet eyes. Oh, you know, the only the other person who consistently does this to me is Dimash. And now I'm saying to myself as I'm watching this, I'm like, I'm wondering if her and Dimash have ever done anything together before, because if they haven't, I sure would like to see them collaborate on something because that would be totally insane. Do you guys know? Let me ask you that. Do you guys know? Has Dimash and Diana and Kudunova, have they ever done anything together musically? If there is, drop that in the links below that I can check that out because, oh, that would be something really cool. Oh, all right. I, I'm... I have the Diana bug now. I like her. I've been bitten by her bug. And yeah, I want to see more of the stuff that she does. Her voice is really insane. Insane. Like, I wasn't quite sure what to make of it the first track that I listened to. I mean, I really enjoyed it, but I just couldn't totally wrap my head around it. But it, now, like, seeing another round of her and the infectiousness of the judges themselves, just like, oh, <laughs> that's the feeling that I feel. <gasps> She's so good. All right, guys. What did you think of this song? Is this the first time you've heard the Elvis cover? Um, and then what do you think I should do next for the reaction? What should come next out of the stuff that she's already got out there? Oh, man. Did it take you guys a while to totally just come down from the high of her music? She's such a beautiful singer. <laughs> Yes. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next reaction. Bye.